Hey everybody, here we are again, and it's the Rich's ginger beer, simply ginger beer, again. I've already seen, seen I've already shown you the packet. I think I showed you the pouches as well, but that's the lid at the top. Lid. Right, so on the bottom of the packet, on the bottom of the pouch, is stuck ginger beer, yeast and sweetener. I don't know if it mentions what sort of sweetener it is. Yes it does. A sulfur may. Is it a sulfur may? A sulfur may K. A C E S U L F A M E K. The ingredients are the same as last time. Well, we'll go through it anyway. Old extract in brackets barley in bold, natural ginger flavouring, hop extract, dried yeast, sweetener, dextrose. Makes 40 pints, 1.8 kilo. Last time, I didn't have the sweetener. I used the usual SO4 yeast. I did think about just adding it at the end. I actually used the first packet. I didn't bin it because it was still hanging around. So that's the second packet, if anyone wants it. Uh, 14.95. I think it came out at the same uh, drop of so original gravity 1046. Finishing gravity 1010. So that's a drop of 36. Came out at approximately 4.891% alcohol. I'll write that down. 4.891. Did it say 4.891? 4 4.891%. Because I haven't written it down. 14.95. Temperatures were 20 and 21, so not worth bothering about. But mainly, we're here to tell you what it tastes like with the sweetener in and using the yeast that it comes with because I, I did think about just banging it in at the end so not actually using the yeast but using the sweetener but then I thought let's go the whole hog chuck it all in so I binned my yeast off I could have saved it I've got a a bottle ready to pour it in I just couldn't be fast so I bought a new packet of yeast technically I used one from stock so it looks about the same crystal clear torch is lacking a bit Same colour, same kit basically. As you see, it doesn't hold a head. <coughs> it had quite a nice head to begin with. It's now down to a ring. It doesn't even hold that by the by the time you get to the end, there's virtually nothing there. Right. So, snifters. You can just about smell the ginger. Just about. Yeah. Let's taste it. Straight off, it's very sweet. Yeah, I'd say very sweet. For a beer, very sweet.
it does bring out the sweetener does bring out the ginger flavor a bit more from what I recall there's a there's a there's a sweetness but a gingeriness up front and the gingerness sort of lasts and lingers and you do get a bit of a ginger burn going down that's all for me that's all for me that's all for me someone pronounce it for me but it does have a very artificial sweetness flavour don't get me wrong I'm still going to drink it but it's it's almost plasticky surprisingly sweet actually for just a does it say it doesn't say how many grams it is but what probably about a 10 gram packet if that and not all of it is sweetness some of it is yeast but yeah you, you, you're left with a it's a artificial sweetness aftertaste is what I'm going for that is more like ginger pop the first one was like a beer but with ginger in it so it's a ginger beer this is more like ginger pop to be honest alcoholic ginger pop don't get me wrong if it was going to brew it again I'd chuck that in the bin I'd also probably get some more ginger because there's not quite enough ginger in it really this the, the, the sweetener does bring out the ginger but the nasty false plasticky sweetness deteriorates from it if it was a a nice sweetness I'd go for it I might would have bother trying it with um, multidextrin or lactose probably not can't be asked can't be, can't be messed it's all right better without the sweetener right like comment subscribe see you next time cheers bye